I'm kind of a hands-on kind of girl, and one of the best ways to separate eggs in order to get all of the white away from the yolk is to use your two best tools, which are your hands. Um, the most important thing starting that, though, is to wash them first. So, soak yourself up, wash your hands really well. And when I separate eggs, I like to use the three bowl method. Um, I like to have one bowl that I um, break the white into, let the white drip through my fingers, and put the yolk into. But then I like to put all of the egg whites, um, after I've done them, I like to put all the egg whites in a different bowl because if you break an egg and you get a little bit of yolk into your egg white, then you can't use it to whip them up because any amount of fat at all will prevent egg whites from actually forming stiff peaks and really um, becoming billowy if you need them for a souffle or anything. And so if you contaminate one egg white, you can set it to the side, but if you have like 10 egg whites you've separated in here and then you get a little yolk in, you've ruined the whole batch. So three bowls, clean hands. Let's get started. In order to get the most out of your eggs, just let them slide right into your hand. And look, this one, perfect example. I've broken the yolk. And if I had had 10 yolks in there, I would have been really, really sad that I just contaminated them and prevented them from uh, being whippable. So that's perfect. We'll move this to the side and put it in a different bowl and uh, start again. And you're also going to want to wash this bowl because now that there's yolk in it, you don't want it to contaminate the egg whites. So wash it really thoroughly. Okay, I've got a clean bowl. Let's try this again. See if I can actually crack an egg properly this time. And when you use your fingers, you can just let all of that white slip through. Sometimes when you toss the yolk back and forth between the two eggshells, you end up getting, um, you're more likely to break the yolk. And um, you also end up getting a little bit of the white still stuck to the yolk, and it's using your fingers is a really easy way to make sure that it separates. So yolk goes in there. My uncontaminated, clean egg white goes into the egg white bowl. And then we're ready for the next egg. Shells can go straight to the compost bin. Be sure to crush them up first. Oh, this one's a tough one. All right, four egg whites, four egg yolks, neither of them contaminated. We're ready to rock. But first, I gotta wash my hands again.